Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Scott Beams and today we're going to be going over how to make something groovy for Cardo Got Wings for his Made Man project. Um, I definitely like the album, man. I'm definitely going to be using his drum kit in this joint too. So, yeah, I mean, no more talking, man. Let's get straight into this Duck Dizzle, you heard? All right, so for my first sound, I went to Xenology and I grabbed this E-Piano and um, I laid down this chord progression. Alright, so I went into the player VST and I grabbed this pad to layer with the chords and this is what it sounds like. Alright, so I wanted something a little unique. I wanted something to like stand out-ish, but um, also let it be like a FX in the background. So I went to Xenology, I got this pop-up effect, and um, I just sprinkled it out through the beat, and this is what it sounded like. And for the effects on that, I have an EQ, I have a delay, and I have a Valhalla Vintage Reverb. And for most of these, I didn't really mix them. I just like panned them a little bit because nothing was really interfering with each other. So I just, you know, like if it sounds good, it sounds good, man. That's why sound selection is so important. All right, so if you know anything about me and this channel, man, you know I'm gonna go to Xenology Bell 7. It's a no brainer, dog. I went to the mini cork, I got this pluck motion, and um, this is like one of my favorite sounds in this VST. Definitely something groovy in the background, some ambient drum. This is what it sounds like. For the effects on that, all I have is an EQ, a delay, and a Valhalla Vintage Reverb. All right, so I went to Triton and I found this sign lead. Alright man, for the bass, you already know I had to go to the to the to the goaded alpha bass, bro. The alpha bass in Xenology is bro, it's, it's number one, not two. You feel what I'm saying? So definitely get on it if you're not on it already. But this is what I came up with. For the effects on that, all I have is the R bass, but I mixed it in a little bit on the side mix. All right, so this is like the start of the show. Like, I'm not gonna hold you. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you, So This VST, bro. This drum, bro. Bro. I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you. I might even make a whole video just on this drum alone. This drum wavy, bro. I'm, I'm a mini chord kind of guy, bro, but the micro chord? I promise you, I, yo, the micro chord is up, bro. I'm, I promise you. It's, it's one of them ones, bro. Listen to it. Just listen to the lead, dog. Like, 
Like it's nothing crazy, it's nothing too, you feel me? But at the same time, it's so subtle and it fits to be so right, bro. But I'm telling you, man, the micro chord, man, it might be the one, dog. That's pretty much it for the melodies, man. Let's get straight into these drums now. Snare. Rim shot. Rim shot. Cowbell. Cowbell. Perk. Triangle Perk Open high hat. High hat. Extra sauce on a hi hat.
Kick drum. Alright man, that's pretty much it for the video man. I hope you found something useful man. If you did man, hit that like button if I'm doing a good job. Make sure you comment below what you want to see next man. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos. Um, I'm going to definitely do a little bit more, you know what I'm saying? I got a mix and draw coming up. I definitely want to do a video with that micro cord. That micro cord is it bro, I promise you bro. So I'm going to show y'all. Instead of just talking about it, I'm going to show y'all for real for real. So stay tuned for that, you know what I'm saying? So that's pretty much it for me man. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace and love, you heard?